Chris Bill is brought to you by Lanza, Walker Valley's best partner. Now will everyone stand for the pledge? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now will everyone bow their heads for a moment of silence? Hey Mustangs, it's Friday, February 3rd, 2017. I'm your host, Trinity. And I'm Carrie. Now it's time for your daily announcements. <music> Students looking for service hours, the Tim Tebow Foundation will be hosting a night of stars on Friday, February 10th from 6 o'clock to 9 o'clock p.m. at First United Methodist Church. If you're interested in helping with this event, contact Carol Ellison at 479-9080 for more information. Also, the ISVAP test will be given on Tuesday, February 28, 2017. Students who are interested in taking the ISVAP test may get a sign-up sheet from the counter in the main office. The forms need to be returned to the main office or to Ms. Keir by Tuesday, February 14th. If you have any questions, please see Ms. Keir. Now it's time for your question of the day. Matthew Pig, Briar Hambright, Copenhagen Wintergreen. I admire the American people's determination. Coach Campbell, my student teacher. Floyd, Floyd Mayweather's money and talent. Seniors, Balfour will be back on campus during lunch hours on Friday, February 10th for you to place cap and gown orders. The prom shop will be open March 18th from 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. This is for any student who would like to get prom formal wear at no cost. It is held at Cross Community Church in Athens, Tennessee. For more information, please see Ms. Cretton. Attention juniors, there will be an ACT boot camp here at Walker Valley on February 25th, 2017. Learn specific time-saving strategies to raise your test scores. See Ms. Jansen in B207 to sign up. Seniors, are you looking for a fun volunteer opportunity? Family Cornerstones is planning a mother and son extravaganza on Saturday, February 18th. Volunteers are needed to help run carnival games. Please call Layla Williams at 284-9980 to sign up for more information. Your book sales are closing. There are only 100 left. You can order online at www.smartpay.com or see Miss Gober and G110. When they are gone, we cannot order anymore. Now it's time for a quick commercial break and then to Cooper with your Walker Valley Sports.
the word of the day and predicate to set evil upon, to curse. What's poppin' B? I'm Hunter, I'm here to teach you how to survive high school. Rule number one, make sure no one sees what's on your hard drive. Remember to sign up your phone in class. <laughs> Most importantly, always remember your headband. Follow these few rules, you might just start this in a year. Walker Valley Sports. Presented by Talk 101.3 The Buzz, your home of the Walker Valley Sports Zone every Monday night at 6.30 p.m. What's going on, Walker Valley? I'm here with your Mustang Sports. Today we will be having a special Super Bowl Fast Five Friday show, so let's go take a look at that. What's going on everybody? Welcome to a special segment of Fast Five Fridays. We actually only have one game for you this week, but everybody knows what it is. It's the big game, the Super Bowl. Super Bowl 51 in Houston, Patriots versus Falcons. Only the second time in franchise history that the Falcons have been there. The Patriots, of course, it seems like are, are used to this. So, who do you have in this one? Are you going with Tom Brady gets his fifth ring, or do you say the Falcons get their first one? Experience certainly in the favor of the New England Patriots. Uh, probably uh, one of the best coaches uh, in the history of the sport and Bill Belichick, uh, arguably one of the best quarterbacks in the history of the sport, Tom Brady. Um, everything lines up to be in New England's favor, but I'm going to take the Falcons. I think the Falcons are a team of destiny. Uh, I think uh, the final year in the Dome, as we were talking about, I think they've been uh, one of the, if not the best teams in the NFL uh, the entire season, certainly uh, the top offense in the league. I think they've got an up-and-comer in Kyle Shanahan, who's, from all reports, going to go on to San Francisco. Uh, I think that offense is dominant, but I think it's going to be the defense that plays a key role uh, for Atlanta. As in previous years, uh, really, it's been the defense that anytime New England loses a Super Bowl, it's a defense that causes a problem. I think Atlanta's defense is going to get to him. They're going to cause pressure on Tom Brady. I still think they're going to score late. I'm going to take uh, Atlanta 42, uh, New England 34. So high-scoring Super Bowl should be a fun one. Super Bowl 51, really looking forward to it. Uh, MVP, I'm going to give you a shocker here. I think Matt Ryan's going to play great. Uh, Taylor Gabriel, the cut wide receiver from the Cleveland Browns, will be your Super Bowl 51 MVP. Atlanta Falcons win. Gabriel, your MVP, Coop. Yeah, my, my heart says Falcons, but my head says Patriots. So I'm taking New England in a very close one in this one. It, it hurts me to say because I don't want to give – um, you know, of course, Coach Webb's not going to like this. I don't want to give Tom Brady any credit. He is a great quarterback, though, and I think he does end up getting his fifth ring. And um, I think Edelman is going to have a breakout game. I think Hogan's going to have a breakout game. And it just seems like, again, they're finding these players that we haven't heard about. I mean, we've obviously heard about Edelman, but Hogan, I mean, who would have thought he played four years of lacrosse, and now he's at this stage. So I'm going Patriots in a close one, 31-27. Julian Edelman gets MVP. I'm going two touchdowns, 90 receiving yards. That's going to do it for this week's Fast Five Fridays. Tune in next year. Um, actually, we may actually get some basketball, uh, March Madness in here. So we, I would we anticipate will have, it, absolutely. Yeah, we'll, but uh, hopefully somebody takes it over next year as I will not be back, sadly. Thank you. Go Mustangs. Remember, don't forget to tweet us your scores and the winner will, will receive a prize package that includes a $10 Subway gift card and a free t-shirt. The winner will be announced on the Spills Twitter account before the game, so be sure to send those scores in before Sunday night at 6.30 to have a chance at winning. Both basketball teams will travel to McMinn Central tonight. The guys and girls look for their third straight wins before heading to Saudi Daisy Tuesday night when they'll resume district play. 
Also, the Walker Valley Track Program has had 80 individual state qualifiers, 47 all-state athletes, 28 individual region champions, and two state champions. If you would like to be part of something great with a lot of history, then see Coach Dunley or Coach Rains to find out more information. The final deadline for anyone that is currently not involved in another sport is Thursday, February 9th. Well, that's going to do it for your Walker Valley Sports Today. Tune in next week for more updates on your Mustangs. I'm Cooper and Nada Gavin with your weather and your five-day forecast. Walker Valley Weather. Sponsored by Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Coverage you can count on. Hey, Walker Valley. I'm Gavin here with your Valley Weather. It is currently 39 degrees with a high today of 44 and a low of 22. Let's take a look at your radar. It looks like our area should stay pretty clear throughout the day and tonight. Now let's take a look at your five-day forecast. This upcoming week should be nice and clear until Sunday, where we may see some light showers in the morning. Monday and Tuesday, there will be more showers. That's all for your weather today. For more information, check out WRCBTV.com. I'm Gavin, and everyone have a great day. You can follow us on Twitter or Instagram at The Spill TV. Like us on Facebook or check out all the new features available for The Spill app on iPhone and Android devices. Well, that's going to do it for our show today. For a complete recap of the spiel, check out our YouTube channel. I'm Cherry. I'm Carrie. And I'm Cooper. Everybody have a great weekend.